Hey, what's up guys? It's Andrew, and today I'm going to be showing you how to track which of your Macs apps are using the data connection by using the menu app loading. Now before loading was released, I had to use the activity monitor that is built into your Mac's utilities in order to track down which apps are using most of my bandwidth, but that got kind of um, annoying and it could get kind of confusing at times. So now with loading, they created a menu bar app that has a menu that lets you see exactly which apps are using your data connection and which apps have recently used it. So to get started, you actually want to download a copy of the app directly from the developer's website because it is not hosted on the Mac App Store. And after you have that unarchived, you will want to go ahead and drag and drop the app to your applications folder. Now that that's there, you go ahead and open it up. The first time you open it, you will get a notification asking if you want to open it. And then after that, you will be able to select if you wanted to open that login. I do want it to open that login, so I'll go ahead and skip the prep option. And then after that, you can see it working. Now an app is actually using my data connection. Right now, it is currently being used by BitTorrent Sync, Google Chrome, and the actual loading app itself. And Google Drive, PushPal, and the system have all used it recently. Now, if you hold down the option key on your keyboard and click that same icon, you will get a more detailed uh, look at which processes are actually using your data connection if you're interested in that. And there isn't many options for this app. The only options you actually have are to check for updates and to open it at login. And that's pretty much it for it. The app icon will spin when the data connection is being used, but if it's not being used, it'll just um, turn into a static version of the same icon. All right, guys, be sure to check out the full guide for this app over at Gadget Hacks. And like always, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one, guys.